boy mate, do you like harsh noise? Do you also like Nirvana or Bad Brains? Okay, okay. How about... What the fuck? Noise rock, sometimes called noise punk, is a subgenre of rock music that sounds like if Mertzbau and Joey Ramone had a band together. The music resembles punk rock, with the only difference being that the guitars are extremely distorted and there's often a tonality in the songs. I like to call it punk rock on crack. Some early bands that popularized noise rock are The Velvet Underground, Sonic Youth, Swans, and Big Black. My personal favorites are Gillaband, Male, and Midori. Okay, so why don't we make some noise rock? First, let's start with the clothing. To be honest, you can wear whatever you want. I mean, look at Dara Keeley from Gillaband in his fancy suit. If you want to be interesting with your performance, smear blood all over your clothes or something. Next, your artist or band name. You need something meaningful without anything explicit. Shit noise! Make your name as abstract or unmeaningful as you want. Noise rock is a type of genre where you can break your guitar's strings and people would call that music. It's okay if people give you bad looks. Oi mate, what's your favorite band? Shit noise! What in the actual fuck? For the logo, you can either take a photo of the band name you wrote on a sheet of paper with a pencil or you can design it in Photoshop. It's your choice, really. Next up, the album cover. You want something abstract, something with a hidden meaning. You can hop into Photoshop and mess with a random image on your phone, or you can make a photo of an abstract painting that you've made. Here's what we'll use for the album, and here's what we'll use for the song. Okay, so let's start writing a song. But before we start, we'll need a couple of effect pedals. There, much better. Now, let's open our digital audio workstation, in my case it's GarageBand, and let's record. For the tempo we need something energetic, fast, upbeat. So let's choose 215 BPM. This song will have a lot of inspirations from hardcore punk, but let's not forget our noise rock elements. For the intro, let's take the weirdest pedal on our pedal board and crank up the weirdness. Now that the intro is done, we need a drum beat. Let's make something aggressive that would make us want to break the vase with the ashes of our grandma. Hell yeah! Okay, let's move on with the guitar. Gain 10. Add extra distortion if needed. Now for the bass, we just follow the guitar. Ooh, perfect. Now, before we do the vocals, guitar noises. Turn on your delay pedal and play a note with vibrato, then add your whammy pedal for a cool effect. Ah, so good! Time for the vocals. You can either scream or just peek in the mic, like you have a conversation with your therapist. You can also add distortion to cover up a bad fry screaming. I'll scream my lyrics. For the lyrics, you can sing the most meaningless stuff ever. But because I'm lazy, I will just take the lyrics of the classic nursery rhyme, Ring Around the Rosy. We all be down the steeple, screaming to the people. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. Why, you motherfuckers? Perfection. Now let's put everything together. If you want to have a raw punk sound, you can uh, skip the mix and mastering part. Now let's export and here is the result.
now that our song is done, we need a music video. Again, something abstract. We can ask our animator friend to do it, or we can film it ourselves in public. Here's what we got. Looks really nice. And here is our first noise rock song. I really hope that you enjoyed my tutorial, and I hope it will help you make your own noise rock song. The song is called Ring Around the Rosie, and it is part of Shit Noises' upcoming album Moments Before Drowning, out on April 23rd, 2023. Thank you very much for watching, consider liking this video and subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!